African men are just like. Uh, uh, African men get jobs. Oh, this is a joke. Guys, the reason I'm saying this. I ain't saying this. But at the same time, we all know like African men everywhere. It's like a lot of like American women that I know, or just not that I know, people in general, like always. They've been talking about African men. Uh-huh. What else is in some program? Some African oh, they sp- like, like to spend money. Like, blah, 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 blah. So, can you, oh, yeah. do you guys agree? Like, word, word, word. that's y'all are just like the creep word. of the crop right now. Like, word. y'all are just like. Word. Say it loud, like, girl. See that word. one? Word. Wait, before that, both word. my, two of my closest, closest friends that I didn't know about Africa when I met them. Uh huh. All of them married to Nigerian men. Wow. First time they met, they said, oh yeah, my sister, I'll see you. I said, you know ah, why? okay. Do you know it feels finally good yeah. to see that. I'm you really, really yeah. appreciate it. You guys just it. naturally. They know where we're from. Appreciate the like, culture. Like, uh, there are American right. females now that are Googling how to make jollof rice. Jollof. It's nice. It's nice. It's, you understand. You understand. Um, it's, you it's understand. Pre- appreciate it. Unlike uh, before where uh, it's before. like, oh damn, you don't even know what pickles is. Yeah, back in the day, I was so bad though. In South Africa, some women, especially like this affluent women that like the flashy lifestyle, mm. they prefer Nigerian guys because the Nigerian guys, they give money. Yeah. So whether they're dating you or it's just a one night smash, mm. the Nigerian guys still pay money. Just like, you know. No, uh, it's business, no law. It's, it's not just business. It's like even when you're dating them, they say, you know, they still treat you better on average yeah. than other guys. So... I've been seeing this topic pop up more and more lately, and I can admit I have seen African American women express loudly and openly that they don't really desire to be with an American man. They more so desire to be with African men. And based off of what I see, the main reason from what I see that most African American women want an African man is solely based off of the fact that they say things like, you know, African men don't go 50 50, you know, African men, they take care of their women. Um, they don't believe in their woman, like working, they shower women with riches and things of that nature. And I'm like, okay, what else is it that you like about African men? Like, do you, is there anything else you like about them? Or do you only like them because you feel like you're going to, you know, be taken care of financially? And um, I know many women, I know African, and I'm not going to lie, their culture is a little different than ours, you know. In African culture, you know, they have multiple wives. You know, African men tend to have many women. And when I look into that, I'm like, the African-American women who say these things, are they aware of that? But I don't think they care. I think it's solely based off of the fact that they just want an easier life. Who doesn't want an easier life? I'm not saying there's anything wrong with it, but it's like, does love come into the picture? Or is it just you want to just live this life of abundance and financial freedom And to my African men, be careful because these African-American women are preying on you all, but they're preying on your resources. I never really hear an African-American woman, African American woman say how they love them for this, this, and that. It's just all about finances and material things. And as far as myself being an African-American man, it does make you feel some type of way. The same way, you know, African American women be like, oh, these guys only like light skinned women, da 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 da. That's kind of how it makes us feel. Like, you don't want us because you feel like we're worthless and we don't have as much money, which that's not really true. It's wild. It's honestly like the hot topic now. And most African American women don't want an American man. They don't. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Everyday with Adora Young. If you've not yet subscribed, this is the right time to do so. Kindly click on that subscribe button and turn on notification for more videos from me. Thank you. All right, <laughs> we'll be talking about why quite a number of women prefer to date and marry an African man. Now, um, please, I want to put a disclaimer. 
if I say quite a number of women like uh, to date and marry an African man, it doesn't in any way mean that non-African men are not amazing and have good qualities. It just means um, that that's what is happening at this point in time. Now, some of the women that prefer this African women that prefer this African men might have discriminating um, reasons, but generally, quite a number of them might just be because it's just a thing of preference. It's just like a man saying, "Oh, um, I like women that have big." boobs or i like women that have big butts it doesn't mean that the women that don't have big boobs or big butts are not amazing and beautiful and attractive it just means that that's their preference or i like light skin women as opposed to um dark skin women it just means that that's their preference i don't know if if that makes sense to you um i agree that sometimes they do say all these things with discriminating intent but good a good number of them is not because they're discriminating it's just everybody has their type and what they prefer all right so i've said that disclaimer and i am hoping that that will be enough to like calm some women or some men that might be offended by this video down all right so moving on Hmm. I think that there are quite a number of reasons why these women prefer African men um, but I think the very first thing that comes to my mind and probably the mind of a number of people that are watching this video is quite a number of African men believe in financially taking care of their women. Now I am Nigerian and I have experienced the deeds um let me put it this way i am nigerian but i do not live in an african country and when i first got to this place the men here are amazing they're awesome they have their good qualities it's just i experienced like a cultural difference that just literally threw me off and i was like no i want my own african men or the type of men that um, i'm used to because i was not used to the type of men i was meeting here you know so i would say that as a nigerian i have experienced the same thing meaning that you don't even need to be dating this african men for them to give you money like you don't need to date them like <laughs> An African guy, let me put it this way, I would, concentrate in, I would concentrate on a Nigerian man because that's the one I have experienced. A Nigerian man will ask you out on a date and pay for everything. Give you money to buy hair, to make your hair, give you money to, to, make your, to buy your gown, to give you money for everything just for that date now you go out on the date and nothing special happens probably you don't even like him and you tell him you don't like him of course it's heartbroken but some of them will still want to keep on trying you and in the process of trying to still be persistent with you to ask you out they'll keep on spending on you they'll spend on you before they get you and then when they get they keep spending they literally set you up on it they literally give you monthly allowance let me call it that way and it's not something that you have to tell him i mean this man from the beginning of the relationship is already telling you okay every month let me use naira every month i'll be giving you hundred thousand naira every month without you asking like that's how much i'll be giving you every single month and he will stick to it and just do it like as if it's part of his to-do list like your monthly upkeep will be part of his monthly um expenses naturally this is not something that you have to be like babe um i want you to put me on your monthly allowance like nah and this same nigerian men are known to complain 
about the fact that, that these women that they spend on end up not spending on them at all like they can never ever give them anything which to be honest i will have to agree 100 percent these people will just spend on you spend on you spend on you the nigerian woman though might not give them money financially but they will take care of them like they would cook for them they'll clean the house they'll start doing wifely duties so i will not say the man is the only one giving in the relationship the man and the woman gives but in different ways a nigerian man feels like taking care of you financially is part of his responsibility by the time he starts dating you even when he has not started dating you but he's seeing green light from you it will just take you as his financial responsibility and just take it like that you understand that's the way these men are and i guess that's the way they were brought up because in an because in a typical african home the man is a provider financially of the home even though the woman has a job and makes good money the man sees it as a thing of pride to never ask the woman for money and he will use his money to take care of the woman and the children and everybody like you can literally see situations where you would see two people that want to get married but then they have been having a long distance relationship nigeria is a very big place a very very big place so you can live um in lagos for example and then be dating someone in abuja but then you have to fly like um one hour in between or two hours flight to get from one place to the other so if you plan on getting married you have to actually move you know and live with the person in the same state that they are in now you see situations where the woman has her own job and the man has his own job in different states and the man is not making as much money as the woman in fact the woman is making it like 10 the woman is making like times 10 of what the man is making and then the man is now asking the woman to quit her job and then come over to stay with him in his own state and the money he's making is not something tangible it could be something like thirty thousand naira and then she she's making maybe like um five hundred thousand naira but he will tell her to quit her own job and then come and join him in where he's living because it's a thing of pride for the man to have money and financially take care of the woman and the family as opposed to the woman being the breadwinner in the home now i am not saying that in africa there is no woman that is a breadwinner in the family i'm not saying that i'm saying that generally an african man feels financially responsible for their woman and i feel like that is the major reason why a lot of women prefer to date african men this is white women black women african women you understand so that's what i think um does that mean that there aren't non-african men that financially takes care of their women of course not i i feel like there are a good amount of them but there aren't a lot um that think that it is not 50 50. i think in western world they believe in 50 50 which that doesn't work in africa yeah there's nothing like 50 50 at least a number of them don't do 50 50 yeah so um but then these non-african men are also amazing uh, it's my opinion that they have really good amazing qualities just like these african men also have good amazing qualities so what do you think do you also agree with me that um a number of people actually prefer african men and why do you think they do prefer african men i want you to leave your comments in the comment section and let me know what you think yeah thank you very much for watching this video don't forget to like share and don't forget to click on that subscribe button and turn on the notification for more videos from me thank you for watching this video and i will see you in my next video bye